Surviving Real Food Ranch. Wholesome, natural, family farming. Good job, Bella. You want to try trotting? We got our cute little pig. Welcome to Reviving Real Foods Ranch Ride. I'm Charlotte. And my name's Megan, and today we are getting ready for pigs. Yes, we are getting pigs. We've never had pigs before. We're uh, right now sitting in the enclosure. We've been preparing for them for their arrival today. So we have just a temporary structure here. This is a portable shelter that um, we've used for a few different things. So it is on skids. And then we have an electric fence set up inside. So this is a temporary situation. As soon as we know that the pigs are trained to this electric fence, then we will be removing the shelter and making them a much bigger area. So they'll be pastured pigs, just like the rest of our animals, and they'll rotate through uh, different parts of our property. We got our cute little pig. <laughs> oh, he's so little. See, he's 11 weeks old. Come on, boy. Oh, I know. Oh, my goodness. turn the fence on so he can start learning. We got the second pig. Her name's Daisy and she is a year old. Turns out she was not a fan of my plan to train her to this electric fence inside this shelter. So after about half a day in there she busted out causing a bit of ruckus because the dogs weren't thrilled with her being out either. I ended up getting her into the closest fenced area which was with the cows and she proceeded to take herself in with the bulls before I could get the fence on. Turns out the Premier One poultry net is a great fence for pastured pigs. So now Daisy and Wiggles are part of our rotation following the poultry at the end of the rotational grazing train. We've built them a shade structure and they seem to be doing well. Okay, here they come. Wiggles getting his name changed. It's Pickles! Oh, I didn't even catch she said Pickles. You said Pickles too. I did? Oh my goodness. <laughs> Thank you for watching Reviving Real Foods. Like and follow for bleed's sake.